If you'd like to lighten and smooth up the trigger pull in your revolver, a replacement spring kit is a good place to start. Let me show you how a few small springs can make a big difference. I'll start by using a trigger pull gauge and snap caps to measure both the single and double action pull weights. This Wolf spring kit is just the ticket for upgrading the factory springs. In addition to the main spring, it contains three different weight springs for the rebound slide. I start the installation by removing the grips and side plate along with the cylinder and yoke. The strain screw located here holds the main spring under pressure. Backing it out a few turns allows me to remove the main spring. Using a screwdriver, I can remove the rebound slide and spring. The Wolf kit includes three different weight rebound slide springs. For the lightest trigger pull, we select the lightest spring. After oiling the spring and rebound slide, I install them back in the frame using the Wheeler rebound slide installation tool. Here's the original main spring next to the Wolf spring. See the power rib along the back of the replacement? This will improve the consistency of the trigger pull as well as making it feel smoother. Once the spring is installed in the frame, it's important to completely tighten the strain screw. It needs to be tight to prevent misfires. Now we can reassemble the gun, attach the grips, insert the snap caps, and check the trigger pulls. That's more like it. About a half a pound off the single action pull and a pound off the double action pull. More important, however, is how much smoother it feels. Be sure to thoroughly test the firearm at the range for proper function. 